So today I'm going to show you how to make this fantastic loaded sweet baked potato in the Ninja Foodi air fryer. I'm just cleaning the sweet potato in the sink using a brush. Dry the potato and add a half cup of water to your air fryer basket. I'm going to close the air fryer pressure cook lid, turn the power on, set it to pressure on high, and the timer for about 15 minutes because this is a larger potato, and then hit start. The lights are going to continue to rotate this way until the pressure builds up and the pin pops up. Make sure your valve is closed. When the timer's done, do a quick release on the Ninja Foodi, and we are going to check the potato to make sure it's done by slipping a knife in uh, in a couple of different areas make sure it goes in nice and smooth while the potato is cooling on the counter i'm just going to saute some uh, onions and some sausage here i'm just adding a little bit of sea salt to it I'm going to saute for a couple minutes before we add the sausage meat also spraying it with some uh, garlic oil that i've made here in the bottle Give it some fresh cracked black pepper. Let it saute for another second or two before we add the sausage. So I'm just going to add the sausage slinks here. That This was about two Italian sausage slinks. And I'm just going to break it up here until uh, there are nice small pieces. And we're going to cook it all the way through until it's nice and brown. And you can add salt and pepper to your taste depending on how you like it. You can also add a little bit of hot pepper if you like. When the sausage is done cooking, you can just set it aside and let it cool while we prepare the sweet potato. So now we're just going to cut the sweet potato in the middle here and split it. Uh, we're going to be removing as much of the potato meat as we can. We can put that all into a bowl. So we're just going to scrape it out using a spoon. It's not going to be pretty, but it's going to be delicious, trust me. And you just pack the rest of it in and make sure we get everything into the skin of the potato before we get it back into the air fryer. I'm going to get all the potato meat and the sausage meat mixture all into a bowl. Going to add a little bit of salt and black pepper and a little bit of olive oil and green onions, uh, just some sliced green onions in there. Mix it all up because we're going to stuff the sweet potato in the Ninja Foodi air fryer. I'm going to give the air basket a little spray of the garlic oil. Gently place the, the sweet potato skin in the air basket. A little bit of oil and salt and pepper if you want it. And I'm going to put some of the stuffing right in here. We're going to pack it in nice and tight and get a nice mound of it right on the top here so we can get nice crispy edges. So before we close it up, we want to give it a nice pack down and maybe a little bit more spray with some, uh, some of the oil. Close the air crisp lid. Select the air crisp. Set it to 400 degrees for a time of about seven minutes, just enough to toast it up. Hit the start button and when it's done we're going to open it up and this is where we add the shredded cheese i'm using a blend of cheddars the uh the orange and the white cheddar and we we'll close it up for another couple of minutes until it's nice and toasted now let's open it up and wow let's take a look at that that is beautiful what a nice crust on that and you see the cheese nice and melted the edge is a little crispy so now let's try to get it out of here. I'm going to use a large spatula. Slide it underneath here and try to get it on a dish without losing it. So now that we got it on a dish, we can take a look at it. Looks nice. It's still very, very hot. So I'm going to let it sit for a little bit before I give it a taste here at the counter. So let's give it a taste. Grab some of the meat, some of the cheese. Mmm. Mmm. It's really good. So let me know what you think of this recipe. Give me some comments, some likes, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.